What's up, trade hackers? Welcome to today's update. What is happening in the markets today? Well, it was up a decent amount earlier looking at the S&P, but is given up a lot of its gains. The S&P at this point is up about three and a half points. We've got about 45 minutes left before the market closes. Dow is down a little bit. NASDAQ is up a little bit and Russell is down a little bit. So a little bit of a mixed bag going into the close. Oil made a big move today down 2.74% at this time. We do not have a position in oil. I was looking at potentially adding one with this big move, but if we look at USO, which is the corresponding ETF, you can see implied volatility is popping, but still not quite to the level that we want it uh, to sell premium. So hopefully we can get a little bit more of a spike in implied volatility, and if so, we will be premium sellers in oil. Other big movers today, kind of a broken record here, but Beyond Meat, another big move, over 7% down this time. So just huge swings in this stock. The market doesn't really <laughs> doesn't really know what to think of Beyond Meat, it looks like. So it's just uh, hold on for a wild ride if you're on any positions in Beyond Meat. And then again, our friend Tesla. So Tesla was up over 8% earlier today. If we look at it now, it's only up about two and a half. So it's really come down off of its highs. We do have a position on in Tesla. So this is actually helping us out a little bit coming back into into center of our reverse iron duck in Tesla. So they, they announced here on the 29th. So we've got a little bit of time, about a week before they announce earnings. So we'll see what happens between now and then. And then a couple other things I mentioned yesterday, Netflix announced earnings and it was pretty even when it opened up and now price has come down. We went ahead and booked profits on that, took a little beak profit in our earnings iron duck. IBM also announced earnings and they shot up. I actually had a little position in this in my personal account, didn't do any alerts in here, but booked a tiny profit, a little beak profit in IBM. And then the other earnings announcement was JNJ. So it started out lower and it's climbed back up to pretty close to even on the day. But that's what we got for earnings. We've also got, after the bell here, we've got Texas Instruments. I took a little took a little trade in here from a trade idea from one of our trade hackers in the community. So thank you, Enrico. And then let's see what else we have on 123. So tomorrow on Thursday after the bell, Intel, INTC announces as well. So those are some of the other big ones. So we've got a shot up to here the last couple of days in Intel. So we'll see what happens after they announce earnings after the bell tomorrow. That's all I got. Everybody have a good evening. We'll talk to you tomorrow.